happening right now. Stockton police officers shoot and kill a violent intruder after they say he tried to force his way into a home and stabbed a police dog. Stockton police and a growing number of agencies are investigating the shooting right now. It unfolded on Howard and Stockton streets. KCRA 3's Richard Sharp is live with some new developments, Richard. Yeah, the scene is being investigated by four different agencies. The Department of Justice, the Sheriff's Office, investigators from the District Attorney's Office, and the Stockton Police Department themselves. And what they're learning about the suspect is that he's had run-ins with the law before. The entire street taped off as investigators go over the scene of an officer-involved shooting. The suspect, who died from his wounds, has a troubled past, police say. He's a 25-year-old man, documented gang member here in the city of Stockton, and he had two recent prior arrests for being in possession of a bladed weapon and another arrest for a resisting arrest. Police say it all started with a man breaking into a group home with people inside. Those people hid in the back room. Officers arrived and tried to stop the man with a stun gun and a police dog. Police said the suspects stabbed the dog and then went for officers. And that's when the suspect put a knife over his head and made advancements towards two Stockton police officers. Fearing for their lives and those still in the house, officers shot the suspect. Scary. I thought it was really domestic violence. People who were visiting neighbors heard the entire event. I just saw one cop car go zooming and then I just heard like pop, 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 pop. And after that, another cop car came and then before you know all kinds of cop cars came and then all of a sudden somebody said somebody got killed. Police are still trying to figure out why the 25-year-old suspect targeted the group home or if any of the residents of that home knew the suspect. And take a look at this. This is a picture of the police canine injured in this incident, a six-year-old Dutch shepherd who's been on the streets for five years. Now, the stab wound was serious enough that he was rushed to a local veterinarian who treated the wound but thought it was serious enough for a second look. The dog was rushed to another veterinarian, this time in Sacramento, where it's being held overnight on observation.